Also new at four today, disturbing details emerging in the shootings of two young children in North Suburban Skokie. Prosecutors now say the accused shooters targeted the kids as revenge for an expressway shooting. The family just spoke for the first time at a news conference. We streamed live on CBS News Chicago and CBS 2's Tim McNicholas is in Skokie for us tonight. Tim. Joe, prosecutors describe a quote hailstorm of bullets on that house in Skokie May 14th. They say two people fired 35 shots into the home, killing nine year old Jeremiah Ellis and wounding his six year old brother. Two of the suspects are 22 year old Christian Anderson and 16 year old Richard Banks. Detectives say they fired at the home, but first cased the house before the shooting, along with a third suspect, Tamisha Clark. The family of the children told police that Clark was the girlfriend of a man killed in an expressway shooting in August. Investigators now believe the Skokie shooting was in retaliation for that, and Clark helped plan it. Detectives say Clark had even posted to Snapchat, I'll smoke you and your kids. Yeah, expletive, I said your kids. Neither police nor nine year old Jeremiah's grandma would go into more details on that. But his grandma did say today that her family has gotten threats since August at a news conference here at the police station. She also described how she dropped to the ground to try to save Jeremiah when she heard shots at her home. My arm tucked under him and I felt blood from through my going through my fingers. I started yelling, call the police, call the police. All three suspects have been arrested and charged with murder. Anderson was also just sentenced in March of this year to 30 days of home confinement and 18 months of probation for an armed robbery. As for that nine year old who died, Jeremiah, investigators say he was celebrating his birthday at that home where his grandparents live and a blanket those two boys were laying on had eight bullet holes. Live in Skokie, Tim McNicholas, CBS 2 News.